Hi everyone, welcome to the Healing Guide TV. I'm Carol Serby. I'm really excited about being here today. Today we are going to learn about how to support the foot chakra by wrapping time. Hmm. If you enjoy the content on my video blogs, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Healing Guide, or follow the link below, there you go, to subscribe to my blog on my website, thehealingguide.ca. You're also welcome to post questions or comments in the reply area, again below. Don't forget, I'm also on Facebook and Twitter. Now, what was that I was talking about? Wrapping time? What is that? Well, do you ever feel as though you don't have enough time? That you're struggling against time? How about time is not on your side? Well, today I'm going to show you how to put time back on your side. I guarantee that if you follow the following protocol, you will never, ever have to struggle with time again. You don't believe it? <laughs> well, neither did I until I tried it. I kept trying it, and it didn't fail me. Not once. It didn't fail me. Not even once. It was so cool. How does it work? Well, it's really actually very easy. When you think about time, do you think of it as a friend or a foe? I want you to start treating time as a friend. I want you to talk to it and I want you to let it let I want you to let it know what you need. I want you to put yourself in a place where you're able to work with it rather than fighting against it. Okay? Set the intention to let time know what you need to accomplish. You need to know what you need to accomplish in what lengths of time. Ask time to wrap itself around what you need to do. Ask time to partner with your tasks, to partner with your experiences, and to partner with what you need to accomplish rather than fight against it. Then you have to trust it. Well, that's the hard part. Trust what comes and that you will accomplish all those things on your need to do list in the set amount of time. I know when I was doing this, there was a couple of times where I went, What? How on earth? I've got cha 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 and to do. How on earth am I going to get it all done in the time that I have left? Well, <laughs> you know how life has those mysterious little ways of kind of circumventing or giving you just what you need when you need it? <laughs> well, that's what happens. Okay. So even though you might be getting to the end of your time slot, and you don't feel as though you've accomplished everything you need to accomplish, just relax. Remember that you would ask time to wrap itself around you, and you'll be amazed at what happens. All of a sudden, something isn't needed anymore, or all of a sudden you get a new tool that takes step six, seven, and eight out of the picture. It's amazing what happens. So just give it a try. If you start to work with time in this manner, I promise you that you will be astounded by the results. Remember, you must embrace time as a partner. If you find yourself not trusting and starting to panic about your timeline, you must stop, stop, okay, and reinitiate time in the partnership. Now, let's be clear. I say reinitiate time in the partnership. Time wasn't the one that wasn't trusting the partnership. You were. Okay? So what we're actually doing is reinitiating you into the partnership. 
Okay. Use this technique to keep you on time. You will also find that it allows you to show up and give the perfect amount of time required to accommodate someone else's needs. Remember, set the intention to wrap the time, tell time what you need to accomplish, and in what time frame. Okay, Tom, I need to do this, 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 and I have an hour and ten minutes to do it. Could you please help me? Okay, and then trust. The process will allow you to honor time, set deadlines, and meet them. Partnering with time makes you look good to your colleagues and your family because you always have time for them. If you have any questions or you want more information, please, at the reply box below, shoot me an email, subscribe, get me on my YouTube channel, get me on Facebook, find somewhere, and they're not hard to find, where you can get a hold of me. Make sure that you don't miss any future videos with awesome information like this. I'd like you to subscribe to my blog and my website, and thank you so much for joining me here today on the Healing Guide TV. I'm Carol Servi. Goodbye.